This is CES MMA. And right now you're looking at Damian the Omen Trice making his way to the cage. It's been quite some time since Trice has fought, since 2011 to be exact, and he did win his last fight beating Justin Switzer here at Twin River Casino. He had some rough luck before that. He had dropped his previous two bouts. He fought Jeff Anderson to a very close disputed split decision and then suffered a submission loss rather to Dan Lozon. And we talked about in the previous bout the bad blood between Matt Doherty and Johnny Campbell. Troitz and Lozon entered that bout with similar bad blood between the two of them. And I think at times in that bout against Danny Lozon, Troitz's emotions may have got the best of him. It happens. What I say about an, an emotional fighter, it's a very explosive charge, but it's very short. And once that burns out, you can't get it. It's gone, it's exhausting. That's why I'm more inclined to, you know, I try to tell the guys, control your emotions and be aggressive, but non-emotionally aggressive. Well, you certainly can't win a fight off pure adrenaline. At some point, skill, technique, everything else takes over. And that's what's gonna be key for Damian Schreitz tonight. We talked about in this intro as well, Andrew Osborne was supposed to be facing Mike Campbell in this card. Campbell right. forced to withdraw. So certainly no easy task. Somebody willing to match with and match fist with Mike Campbell must be a pretty tough opponent. So Damian Schreitz will be up against it when he gets in that well, cage. Here's the funny part is you, you have Andrew who's six and five with one knockout. And then you have Damon, who's identical record at six and five, but he has five submission wins. Right. So it's, it's, you're looking at who's finishing. And if it if it goes to the ground, you're kind of going to lean towards Damon. All right, tail of the tape. Damon Trites again, six and five at one knockout, weighed in at 164 yesterday, fighting out of Team Link. And Andrew Osborne also six and five at one knockout, fighting out of Fayetteville, North Carolina. Let's send it down to Bill Carpenter for the official introduction. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Jim Beam Bow, scheduled for three. Five minute rounds of mixed martial arts fighting in the cage. Lightweights, your referee will be Kevin McDonald. Introducing the blue corner, he's wearing white trunks. This mixed martial arts fighter weighed in at 165 pounds. His professional record shows six wins with five losses. Fighting out of the Angel Gym in Fayetteville, North Carolina, please welcome Andrew Ozzy. Osborne. Across the cage to my left, fighting out of the red corner. This fighter's wearing the black trunks with red. He tipped the scales at 164 pounds. His six professional wins include five submissions and one knockout, representing Team Link. He's fighting out of Springfield, Massachusetts. Introducing Damian. The Omen Trice. Damian Trice. Three five minute rounds. Damian had a fantastic ground game to begin with. Now working out a, you know, up there with Gabriel Gonzaga and the rest of the guys from Team Link. It's, it's going to be fun to see what improvements he's made. You made a very good point in the intro, Scott. A very different six and five on both sides. Osborne is going the distance in three of his last four wins. Troitz, meanwhile, has five submissions, uh, five out of his six victories by submission. So it'll be interesting to see whose style takes over. Osborne in the white trunks, Troitz in the black with the red trim. Well, you can see where Osborne seems to want to set his hands up, wants to strike. A little looser, hands are a little higher. Damon's just trying to work his way in. Troitz trying to work his way in. There's more movement coming out of Osborne. Big overhand right, I think that kind of caught the shoulder and it looked like it, Ozzy felt their pain in that one more than uh, Damon did. Troitz no doubt anxious to get back in, hadn't fought before Superman tonight since 2011. Punch. Three right hands in a row goes right for that takedown. I like the way he, he used his hands to set up the takedown attempt and he was just turned around immediately by Osborne. Trite's got to look for an underhook here, to, and he goes down and right back up. Obviously, Osborne wants to keep it standing. Nice combinations, both guys throwing leather, both guys landed. Nice exchange here in the opening round. 
Trites goes right back in, dove in for that takedown. He's trying to get a double. Now he switches to a single, and Osmond did a good job of pulling his head right back up. When you have good head control, that's really going to dictate where your opponent's going. Trites now with double underhooks. And just as I say that, Osborne uh, pummels in and secures double underhooks on his side. Right now, both fighters are jockeying for small position. You can see where Osborne keeps his nice takedown, just kind of threw him down hard. Very muscular move there. Osborne showing his strength, just picking up Trites. And as you said, tossing him to the ground. And you can see Trites waving him in. Very comfortable on his back, no and doubt about that. That's where he wants to fight. Now, nice body head there. Right to the body, left hook to the head. Trites hits doubles, puts him against, uh, excuse me, got one underhook now. He's working hard on a single. Osborne's gonna do a cross face, and pull his head clean up. That's his best out. Trying to, try to switch for the double there, went back to the single. A knee on the out by Osborne, and they clinch again. Damien just jumped guard. You can see a wider angle view. He's being he's being held up there. He tried to take him down by jumping guard. Osborne did a great job of holding him up. Very strong guy. Yeah, Looking very much, his, very much in control here in this opening round for Andrew Osborne, seemingly having his way with Trites at times. Well, you you heard Osborne's corner yell, "Step back, step back!" And again, Trites jumps guard. He wants this on the ground. He wants to play jiu-jitsu. Steps back to let him back up. Osborne. Having none of it. Both footers back to their feet. A minute and a half to go in round number one. Damon working very hard for that single defended well by Osborne. You can see Osborne going for 100% here. He's going to take on a reached over his head, has it over under on the arm, and he's gonna try to rip that behind him. Nice short elbows. Now, David Trites eating some ground and pound from Osborne here. Really hitting some high leather shots. Five or six up. unanswered blows here, Scott. I think Scott. we're counting seven or eight here. Trites really not doing a whole bunch. To, that's that's it. it, that's it, that's the fight. Trice just not answering, unable to answer really with the strength of Andrew Osborne. Just unloading with the ground and pound and finishing Damian Trice in round number one. A very surprising turnaround in the quick transition from suddenly Trice being on his back and not able to defend himself. Well, anytime that your, your opponent has his position on the ground, don't forget, you know, Osborne has a ground game too and apparently it's ground and pound. And he did it very well. And for Andrew Osborne, his first knockout since 2011, he had won his previous three bouts all by decision going the distance, but tonight showing his ability to stop and finish his opponent as well. So a very well-rounded fighter and a well-rounded performance. We're going to see how this one all went down, Scott. It really did happen in an instant, but right now you're seeing Troy is just unable to stop the onslaught. Yeah, you know, he's, he's if you look over, Osborne's not leaning a whole bunch. He has good hip position, good Good, real basic mechanics, keeping his hips heavy while he's driving down very hard shots. And he's, you know, this is what you tell some of your fighters outside and then inside. He threw a left hook, right cross, couple straight right hands, you know, right down the middle. And then when the when the guy's defending right in the middle, come on the outside, and he picked his punches very well. You know, McDonald may have given Troitz a little more rope than he might have given some other fighters, but an appropriate stoppage nonetheless after too many excessive blows. As a referee, knows it's the, the guys that are in there. He knows that these guys have been around. You know, he's seen Damon 11 times now. So of course you're gonna turn around and, and oh, give yeah. that couple of extra, oh, yeah. as opposed to, you know, a fight you might not be as familiar with. Well, tough loss for Damian Trice in his comeback. He had not fought since 2011. He was coming off a win in that bout, but suffers the loss tonight, knocked out by Andrew Osborne. Let's send it down to Bill Carpenter for the particulars. Ladies and gentlemen, the bout comes to an end at four minutes, 34 seconds of the first round. Referee Kevin McDonald halts the action due to excessive unanswered strikes. 
your winner by TKO, Andrew Ozzy Osbourne.